When I was just a boy, my father helped me develop my passion for the outdoors. That passion quickly turned to an obsession. Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Adventures of Field. I am your host, Eric Henderson. This is a very special episode. It is 17 years in the making. I'm really looking forward to this one. Back in 2006, I went to South Africa with a couple buddies of mine with a 457 caliber air rifle. This air rifle was producing 570 foot pounds of energy. That's a 510 grain hard lead bullet doing 710 feet per second. Back in 2006, that was a lot of energy. 2007, a friend of mine, Stefan Bowles, wanted to buy that air rifle from me. So I sold it to him and he wanted to go do a hunt with it. We went to the wildlife ranch in Mason, Texas. We shot a couple animals and he wanted to shoot something bigger. So I was asking him, what did you want to shoot? And he said, a bison. So I'm thinking, okay, we can do that. So I found a bison and he flew to Dallas from California, loaded up in the truck and we headed down south. I hope you enjoy this. What are they doing? Right now they're out there um, searching around to see if they can find a buffalo. We've been riding around now for a while. And um, see, this is what we saw the last one, what well, the first and last one we've seen so far. And <clears throat> They're in the process to see if they can find him, maybe in the same general area, area. but um, it's very, very exhilarating, to say the least. You know, when I first saw this one, that, that buffalo was huge. The one, I, the one I saw was huge. So I can't even imagine the beast I'm going to be killing. And you know what? I chose this bullet to do the deed. 510 grams out of the safari gun. This will do the job. Stefan and his guide Gary set out on foot to locate the bison. It didn't take too long to find them. Get behind that brush, guys. I'll try to get out. Huge. I mean, that buffalo must with the how much? They're 1,800, 2,000 pounds. 2,000 pounds. That's incredible. 2,000 pounds. With this slug. Oh, yeah. It's nothing like throwing lead down range with air. The terrain in the hill country of Texas can be thick, making a shot very difficult. The guys wait for the bison to move off to a more open area for a clearer shot. Eventually, they made their way to an open area and gave Stefan the clear shot he was waiting for. Remember to breathe. Front or back? Front on the right. Yeah, go ahead. Yeah. Good hit. 
Yes. Good hands. He's going down. He's going down. to explain how I feel right now. And that's the honest God truth. That big boy right there, 2,000 pounds. Where'd you put the shot? Right through the lungs and right through the lungs. Right through the lungs. You went to the rough, right? Right to the rough, yes I did. Feeling off here right now, I can't explain it. This is awesome. Woo! It's amazing. An air rifle. Oh my god. Good shots, both of them good shots. Uh, I've had a lot worse happen with the regular firearm. Where it's taking 20, 30 minutes to even get a second shot. <laughs> Maybe 45 minutes for it to expire. <laughs> and this guy is down and out. Yes. Oh, thank you. Oh, my God. I can't believe it. God, he's huge. Oh, man. Look at him. That air rifle did a number on him. Okay. Unbelievable, huh? It is. Wow. Look at that. Oh. I tell you right now. There is nothing that can prepare, I don't think anyone, for hunting, I mean, something this huge, this big. Oh, thanks, You're thanks welcome. so much. You're welcome. You made two really good shots with that air rifle and took him down. DAQ, probably the best air rifle ever made. <clears throat> well, I'm sure it is. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy, this is awesome. What do you think of that beast? Oh man, it's incredible, man. I can't believe it. I can't believe how huge he is. Massive, man. You know what? I would never have dreamt. If I could have looked at a crystal ball and saw that, well, you know, in 2007, you're going to be killing a buffalo with an air rifle. I would never have believed it. Man, this is awesome. I will never forget this hunt, never. The sport of air gun hunting has come a long way since 2007. With the advancement in technology, air guns are producing significantly more power, like this Umarex air guns hammer, 50 caliber, this thing's doing over 700 foot pounds, but it's not just air guns themselves that are advancing in technology. The ability to acquire an affordable air gun compressor has come a long way. This Umarex Ready Air 4500 PSI air compressor, this thing can fill your gun with no problem. 
one of the best parts is 12 volt DC compatible so you can fill your gun out in the field. Thank you for watching this episode of Adventures of Field and remember it's not just about air guns but it's all about adventure. It's amazing, an air rifle.